Friends, welcome. Welcome to Second Presbyterian Church. Welcome to this service of worship. We are glad you are here. Second is a welcoming community of faith. We're believers where Jesus Christ transforms lives. So in a busy and stressful time of year, we hope you find meaning in this service of worship this morning. Let me highlight for you a couple of announcements. First of all, a very sincere thank you to everyone who helped with Christmas benevolence this year. Our final delivery day was yesterday. This year, we served over 150 families comprised of over 700 individuals. So to the deliverers, to the sorters, to the packers, to everyone who helped, thank you. And a special thank you to Reverend David Berry, who is unfortunately ill this morning, to the moderator of the deacons, Carol Pack, and to the co-moderators of the Christmas Benevolence Committee, uh, Carl Snipes and Brad Yarger, for their tremendous leadership. As we complete or move closer to this, the end of this season of the unfolding mystery, we have an opportunity tonight to take part in a contemplative service of worship at 2nd at 6. Also, uh, if you have the moment to spare, in room 356, our Bethlehem Labyrinth has been set up. That will be open through Tuesday and is a space for contemplation, prayer, and meditation. Meditation. And finally, a note for next Sunday, the 24th, it'll be a busy one around here. We will have one morning worship service at 10 a.m. here in the sanctuary. The evening services will be as usual, 4 o'clock, 7 o'clock, 9 o'clock, and 11, 4 a.m., or 4, 4 p.m., I promise it's p.m., <laughs> The 4 p.m. service is for the young and the young at heart. That's intended for families with young children. 7 o'clock will be led by the youth and college students. The 9 o'clock service by our choir with lessons and carols and candlelight. And 11 o'clock will be lessons and carols and communion.